Hey, what's going on everyone? So, if you've been following along, you know I'm starting a lot of projects. And I just can't get going on a lot of them. So what I'm going to do today... Well, yesterday I started on the Arbor project. And I'd been putting it off, and I don't know why, I just kind of looked at the logs and just all of a sudden started working on it. And it felt a lot better to be working on it, even if I only got a little bit done. So what I'm going to do today is actually go around my property and just start every project. Um, that way I know what I need for it, get everything set up, and I'll feel better. And then I'll just... The hardest part is getting started for me. Um, I get overwhelmed sometimes with everything going on. So I'm going to get started. Hey everyone, uh, welcome to Tiny Hilltop. This is Nate, I'll be your host. Today I'm gonna be throwing up a 40 foot hoop house. I already bent the hoops. I made a video on how I go about doing that if you're curious. I also squared it up. So what I need to do next is measure out the sides and get some rebar in the ground, use them as a, as a base for the hoops. Got some wood chips. I found a few places around here that have wood chips that I can pick up. One of them my cousin-in-law works at, I guess. Um, the, this one my dad grabbed from another place just because he was in, in, in over by them and he saw that they had wood chips, so he got, them, got me some. So I'm gonna jump up there and get these unloaded. Unfortunately, today is the day that the tailgate decided to stop opening. It was always a little, he had to be real gentle with it, um, but this time something popped. So I'm going to try to get in there with some channel locks and see if I can't snap it open by hand. If not, it's going to be a lot of shoveling over top, but I got chips, so such is life. I'm excited for some chips. I can honestly say I did not expect that to work, but it did, so I'm going to get to getting. So a slight change of plans, I'm going to give this area right here a quick little haircut and lay some chips and then I'm going to spread the grass clippings on top. The chips look like they're really good chips but they do look as if there's not a lot of green matter in there so I'm going to add some green, some green material to them.
So this is the area I'm trying to clear for the girls to fence in a run. My goal is to have them be women of the woods, some forest chickens out there scrounging up for some food. They don't seem to be in a huge hurry. They're enjoying their little wood pile right now. They kind of meander out every couple hours and scratch through some wood chips and eat my Josta berries. But it's cool, that's why I'm growing them. So anyway, today uh, my goal is just to kind of cut down, knock down some of the long stuff and get some larger sticks out of here so I can get working. I'm gonna clear it all down to the ground and then plant some, some better grass and create almost like a paddock system for them uh, with grass as well as um, I'm gonna section off a few different areas to move compost through. Um, once I have it all established and, and all built, I'm gonna go back, when I get my cart up and running, I'm gonna go back to our hardwood stands and get some big piles of leaves for them to pick through and break down for compost for me. Long term, my goal is to really have this area work for me as far as moving compost and organic matter through it. Um, but right now, short term, I just gotta start clearing it out. I got a lot done today, started some projects. I feel a little bit better now that I at least started them. I feel like it'll be easier for me to get up and get going and attack them now and get them done quicker. But for now, I gotta take this thing apart. My pops put a bigger stick in there than this thing can chip, so it's stuck. He thinks he's legally bound to chip anything I put in the pile. When in reality, I put some big ones in there and I hope he chips it down and then he can just toss it to the side. But it'll be fun to take this thing apart, so that's what I'll be doing the rest of the day. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it. Catch you later.